the biggest way you manage that is that you know right away that you do not do everything. Part of being the leader in those settings is managing others who are expert at those particular areas. You have someone who runs the admissions operation. You have someone who is responsible for student life. You have someone uh, who is charged with helping you manage the faculty. You're involved with each of those things, but the the idea that you could you could be individually responsible for all of that and and the sort of overarching running of the institution is just not possible. And it's a fool's errand to think that you can you know know everything about everything uh, as a leader. That's not what leadership is. I think leadership is about assembling great teams of people and inspiring them to be truly excellent at what they do. And then using that excellence and bringing that together and that creativity to you know, solve the big institutional problems and to you know, create a vision for the institution that is inspiring for everybody. Uh, yes, as the leader, you step in and you have to understand what's happening. And, there are certain things that only you can do. And one of your jobs is to know what those things are. Uh, but it's not about doing everything. Uh, it's about knowing how to find the people to do it, to make them feel that they're valued for the knowledge and expertise that they bring to the table. And you know, launching that uh, on behalf of the, of the institution. 